How are you doing? It's Wilson here. I was wigged up in bed with flu. <coughs> it's not so good at all, really. Mind you, it was as good as weather. Not so good, is it? Anyway, Boston come this morning with a new poem for me to read to you. Richard Grandin. You'll like it. It's bloody funny. Well, they tell me it is. I can't see funniness in it anyway. Here we go. Now then, there was a national poetry competition held at Lancaster Town Hall many, many years ago. And two semi-finalists were a fellow for eight grammar school and a fellow for eight Millthorpe secondary modern school. Now, to get, when they get into the final, they had to make a poem up containing one word. And word was Timbuktu. <coughs> <coughs> now then, Timbuktu. Not a right good word to make a poem out of. Anyway, Matey Fred Grammar School, smart looking fella, shiny shoes, brill green, blazer, tie, bloody a right tough. He comes up with this. Slowly across the desert stand, trek the lonely caravan. Men on camels, two by two. Destination, Timbuktu. Well, they went mad. They thought it was bloody marvellous. What a fabulous poem, eh? Two minutes it took them to make that up. Anyway, lad for it, modern school, get something grabbed out of microphone. Scruffy old bugger. No tie on. Dirty shoes. Brown shirt. And he comes up with this. Me and Tim hunting went. Met three horse in a pop up tent. They was three, and we was two. So I booked one, and Tim booked two. <laughs> Pretty funny that.